check out what I just ordered. Should be arriving today. All right, guess what just arrived at the door? Oh. It's my Amazon box. Let me just quickly fix that. So today I was filming my unboxing slash review of the new mic that I just got for my phone, which is the Rode Video Micro, only to find out that the included cable doesn't actually work with my iPhone. So I'm gonna have to get a new one. I just ordered it on Amazon and it should arrive tomorrow. In the power of video editing, here it is. What is up YouTube? Today I've got something super special for us and that is I got a new mic for my iPhone. Now it might not be very exciting for other people but for me I've been using an onboard mic for the past few videos so this is super exciting. Anyways I got the video micro from Rode. I'm using it right now and you can tell me how it sounds compared to my past videos but also see if I could do a comparison between the two with it plugged in and without. This microphone is compact and lightweight. Its build quality is superb. It's an all metal build and it doesn't require any battery at all. It drops all the power it needs from the source, which could be a DSLR, it could be a mirrorless camera, or it could be a smartphone in this case. But if you wanted to buy it for your smartphone, make sure you don't make the same mistakes that I did and just order that video micro because I ordered it and plugged it in and it didn't work. Now, after a few minutes of research, I found out why. The phone needs a TRRS plug, whereas the cable that came with it is only a TRS. Now, I'm not a very technical person in terms of audio, so you guys can let me know what that means. All I know is I needed something that will work with the iPhone. So, I picked up the SC7, which is a TRS to TRRS patch cable. And with that, plugged it in, worked no problem, as you can see. Now inside the box, you'll find the Rode mic itself, as well as a shock mount and a Deluxe Fury windshield, which I'm using currently. It comes with a two-year extended warranty when you register your microphone. And if you're here at the video, then you probably already know that Rode makes excellent audio products. I just want to say that this video is not sponsored by Rode. I bought this for myself because I needed a new mic. I came out for a quick walk in this gorgeous day. It is super sunny, almost no clouds in the skies except for the clouds that is directly behind me, but not directly above me. And I'm gonna give you guys a quick demo between the road mic as well as the onboard mic. So right now it is using the road mic plugged in and you guys can let me know how that sounds. So I just unplugged the Rode mic and it is now using the built-in microphone in the iPhone 7 Plus. I think it's going to pick up a lot more background noise and the sound quality might not be as clear. You guys can let me know. And now back to the Rode mic. I just plugged it in and you can let me know in the comments below which one you think it's better. I feel like I know the answer to that but some people may surprise me. So I just sat it down and it turns out my stand is way too low so I'm just gonna crouch like this. So right now I have it plugged in to my Rode Video Micro. I'm about more than an arm's length away for sure, like about three, three feet away. Let me know how it sounds. Alright, same comparison without the mic plugged in. Right now it's using a built-in mic and same distance, let me know. Just a quick comparison.
comparison between the two different mics while behind the camera and behind the microphone. So both camera and microphone are both facing forward and this is the video micro plugged in. And now this is without the microphone plugged in and using the built-in microphone from the iPhone. I'm about a foot away behind the camera while it is still shooting forward. So in the midst of having fun yesterday within the music night, I definitely forgot to unplug the mic to do the comparison between the two while somebody is playing. So I've got a short clip of myself playing and keep in mind it's definitely not very good but it was definitely filmed with an iPhone microphone. So I'll show you with uh, two other videos that is filmed with the road mic and you can see the difference yourself. Come on baby with me Alright, that's it for the review. As you can see, I didn't put a lot of music video footage because I have decided that all that will be in a separate vlog. So that was just a little taste of how the mic perform. So stay tuned for that. Make sure to hit subscribe button so you can catch all the future videos. And if you feel like feeling awesome, press that thum thumbs up button and share with your friends. And remember, live in the moment, stay awesome, and I'll catch you in the next one.